my goodness, they've all got spots. This clue means we could either get little Kansas cutie, little tins, or little goodie. Who do you think it will be? Put your guess in the comments. Hooray, hooray for health clinic day. I'm so excited. I am a doctor now and I get to open my own clinic and help patients. It just feels so nice. Would you like to see Bon Bon open her new health clinic? If so, hit the thumbs up button and click to subscribe. Let me see here. Okay, ah! oh no, nothing's ready inside. Well, the building is nice. But it's so super empty in here. None of my supplies are ready. Okay, Bon Bon, time to get to work. First, I think we should put in a patient's bed. I need a place for my patients to lay down while I examine them. Here is a cabinet. I can put some of my books in here and medications for patients. Got a couple more of those things. Here we go. We want to keep them away from small children. I can close that up and hang it here on the wall. A doctor needs more storage. So here's a counter with some drawers to put supplies in. We'll set that under the cabinet. My medical bag can go there. Here's our eye chart for checking patients' eyes. They have to be able to read it. That hangs on the wall. I also have a desk to work at. Let's set that over here and put in a chair. Other things in my office to display is the skull. I've got some more books here, some other medication, a chart, and a file to go through. Let's bring in the scale to weigh our patient. Here is a tray that has supplies on it, like a bandage and some other medical tools. There we go, that rolls right around. Everything's looking pretty ready in here. Oh, I've gotta get myself ready. Let's put on my scrubs. That works good. And my stethoscope. Doctors always have their stethoscopes ready. Now I'm ready to help any patients that come in. No patients are here now, so maybe I can get a little bit of my work done. Oh, Dr. Bon Bon, Dr. Bon Bon, I've got a big problem. Oh my, Prankster, what is it? Are you not feeling well? No, I'm feeling fine, but come on in, girls. Oh my goodness, they've all got spots. I know, and they can't stop itching. Doctor, can you help them, please? Certainly I will. All right, girls, I'm gonna need all of you to hop up onto the bed. It's so itchy. I know, girls. All right, just let me check you up first. I'm gonna listen to your heartbeats. Make sure everybody's doing okay. That all sounds good. Now we'll check on your reflexes. Okay, hold still. Oh, oh, itchy, itchy. Here's a thermometer. Let's check your temp. Ooh, a little high. You too. Oh my goodness, you've all got temperatures. What's gonna happen, Dr. Bon Bon? What's wrong with them? Will it go away? It will. They've got a case of chicken pox. What? It's from a chicken? No, no, no. It's just what they call it. It's just itchy red bumps. I don't like them. I know, and it's best not to scratch. So I'm gonna give you some treatment to help make you better. Alright. Okay, Prankster, help me put on this ointment. I'll squirt it on and you rub it in. Okay. Rub, rub. Okay, all over on all your spots. Everybody. Oh, that's feeling better. I bet if we let them rest a few minutes, they'll start feeling better very quickly. That sounds great. We'll just put this screen up for a little privacy while you guys rest. Nay, nay, nay. Oh my goodness, Punk Pony, what's going on? What's the matter? Nay, nay. Oh, your paw? Oh, is it your hoof? Nay, nay. Well, I'm really not a vet. <laughs> okay, but I'll try to help. Uh, let's see, did you hurt yourself roller skating? Nay, nay. All right, um, then we need to get those skates off. Now let's check you out here. I should listen to your heartbeat. Heartbeat sounds good. <laughs> hmm, maybe we need a little x-ray. Come over here, let's take a picture. <laughs> here, Punk Pony, look. You've got a little break in your foot. <laughs> it's gonna be 
okay, but I do need to put a cast on it. And I'm going to give you a little shot to help the pain. Nay, <laughs> nay. I promise it'll make it feel better. Just a little shot right here. Nay, nay. Oh, and there's the cast. Nay, <laughs> nay. You're welcome. Now, no roller skating for a while. You need to take it easy. Nay, nay. <laughs> bye bye, Punk Pony. Let me go check on my little chicken pox girls. I'll just pull the curtain out of the way. Oh my, you girls look so much better. I feel better. No more itchies. Yeah, me either. Your spots are all gone. The medicine really, really worked. I can't believe it, Dr. Bon Bon. You did an amazing job. Well, they could probably still use some rest, but you can go ahead and go. Come on, girls, come on. Tell Dr. Bon Bon thank you. Thank you, Dr. Bon Bon. <sighs> well, it sure has been a busy morning. Uh, uh, I'm going to, I'm going to. Uh, oh my goodness, oh my goodness, the queen, the queen. Come on, come on, are you all right? I just don't have any energy, so tired. Let me help you onto the bed. Well, your heart is going a little bit fast. Temperature? Temperature looks good. And reflexes? Oh my, your reflexes are a little slow. Why don't you tell me about what you've done today? Uh, I woke up and did a little exercise by running through the park. And then I was cleaning my house. And I went shopping for groceries so I could start getting food ready. And I was inviting friends over. Um, you did stop to eat breakfast, right? Hmm, uh, breakfast. No, I don't remember eating breakfast. Oh my, the queen. Food gives your body energy to do all those things. That's why you're so tired and passing out. You need to eat. Oh, I was just so busy. But you always need time to eat something. Wait here, I'll be back. Why don't you go ahead and sit up? I've got some food here for you. Here, a little bit of something to drink and some oatmeal. Mmm, that is good. Let's take a few bites of this. Mmm, I'm starting to feel better already. And a little more to drink. Oh yeah, I'm getting a lot more energy now. Whoa, 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 slow down. Let's just lay down and take a rest for a little bit first. Yeah, I could do that too. Ah, phew. Here we go. Just take a little nap. You'll feel better. My goodness. I might need a little food break to get some more energy. Oh no, I think someone else is coming though. Whoa, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Wait, come back. Hey, woo. Oh my, a little sister. A brand new little sister. I bet you could use a checkup. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, well, I gotta get you out of there first. If this new little sister from Series I Spy is going to get a checkup, we need to get her out of here first. I've gotta peel this away so that we can get her out. Got it. Oh, and I already see our paper for our secret message. And it's an I Spy. So we need our spy glass for Pet Lover. Still some more opening to do. Here we go. Oh my goodness. Just peel away. Round and round, got it. Okay, nothing under there. We just have some more wrapping here. I'll peel that wrapper off so that we can get to this ball. This pretty bright pink ball. And what's inside? Ta-da! Oh boy, lots of fun surprises. Like this here, some shoes. Let me get them out. Look at these adorable little pink shoes and silver bows. Now what's this? Hmm, rather large bag for, ooh. A very large silver crown. That must be for someone special. And now we get to open up and see who we have here. <gasps> Look at this hair. How cute is this? It's little Goody. Did you guess that we would get little Goody? If so, say I got it in the comments. 
Here, little goody. Let's see how you can change colors. What do we see? Dark pink hair on top and a pink outfit with little socks. She's even all pink and polka dotty on the back. I guess I better give you a checkup. Let's listen to your heart. How's his sound? Sounds good to me. Let's check your weight. Come on over here to the scale. Oh my, big girl. Yeah, big girl. Now let's see if you can read the chart. What's it say? I see you, house, X, number two, a flower. I see lots of stuff. You did good. I think you're pretty healthy. Do you have a problem though? I can't leave the clinic and you can't stay here. Oh no, what do we do? Huh, oh, what's going on? Huh, what's happening? What's happening? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, calm down, calm down. You were just taking a nap. Oh, I didn't recognize where I was. Oh, hi little goody. Hi, the queen. Oh, thanks for letting me take a rest and eat something. I'm definitely feeling better. And I won't forget to eat anymore. I'm glad to hear it. Listen, do you think you could take little goody for me? Oh yeah, I'd love to. Come on, little goody. Let's go have some fun. Bye now, bye. Huh. I may need a bit of a rest after such a busy day. This doctor is now the patient. Oh no, we need help. We're stuck. We're stuck. We can't get out of here. Who do you think we could get inside? Could it be Spice, Curious Cutie, or the Queen? Put your guess in the comments. Ah, the weather looks great for a super fun pool day. Let me just test the water. Ah, perfect. Sissy, Sissy, where's my float? Where's my float? I don't know. Where did you leave it? I don't know. Uh, our friends will be here soon. Yay, yay! I'm going to get in the water now. What about your float? Uh, I don't know. I'll just swim for now. Oh, hey, Waves. Hi, SPF cutie. I found this float laying out in your yard. Oh, there it is. Yay, my turtle float. I guess she was looking for it, huh? Oh, yeah, she's always losing stuff. Ready to get in the pool? I think I might lay out on that chair for a little bit first. Oh yes, it is very nice. Well, I'm gonna hop in. The water's amazing. And I will lay down right here. But wait, I can't forget my sunscreen. Don't wanna burn. Looks like our LOL dolls are already having some fun at the pool. Would you like to see what else is gonna happen? If so, hit the thumbs up button and click to subscribe. Hi guys, hope we're not too late. Now jump in. Okay, wait. Oh my goodness. She does love the pool. Well, I might as well get in too. Hi little waves. Hi there. I like your turtle raft. Can I get in there too? Yeah, sure. Come on in. Woohoo, go turtle, go. Oh, it's kind of crowded in here. Yeah, maybe too crowded. I want to practice my swimming, but ugh, I can't get out. I can't get out. Oh no, we need help. We're stuck. We're stuck. We can't get out here. Oh, oh, I guess this raft is not made for two people. Oh, oh, I can't get out. All right, girls. All right, hang on. I got you. Whoa, whoa. Thank goodness. Maybe you should just do that one at a time. Yeah, I'll go swim. I think I'll swim too. Then I'll put the raft up here. Oh no, we're gonna get you, girls. Watch out. Ah, ah, ah. No, don't get us. Don't get us. You can't hide from us, little shortstop. We see you back there. Uh uh, I'm hiding. Gonna get you, gonna get you. Oh no, we're splashing, huh? Splash, splash, splash. Oh, swimming's exhausting. It is getting a little warm out here. Maybe I should take a dip. What else could cool me off? Oh, I know. I can have a bit of yummy, yummy ice cream. Mmm, strawberry. My favorite. Hey, Weaves, I see you have that towel there. Who's that for? Just a special guest. A special guest like who? You'll see. I'm here, I'm here. Wait, who is that? LOL Surprise Glam Glitter. Ah, if only I could stretch out on this towel. We'll help you out. How special an LOL Surprise Glam Glitter series doll has come to the pool party. But she needs a little help getting out. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna help her out of there. Here's our secret message. Diamonds are forever. Unzipping. And we'll unwrap. I like how the wrappers are kind of different. 
Our glitter series can do one of these things. Just need to peel away a bit more. Ooh, neat. A pearl ball and a surprise. Let's open it up, see what's in it. It's our water bottle. This one is red with a white glitter top. So squishy. Couple more layers and more surprises to find. Like this one here. Let's see what it could be. <gasps> shoes, white glitter shoes. Aren't these neat? Time to get our last wrapper off. Peel that away. And I can open this up. Here is a surprise. Come on out. Whoa, look at this outfit. It's like a gold shimmery jumpsuit with a silver glittery belt. This is cool. Now to open up the bigger ball. There we go. First, I'll open up this surprise bag. A red glitter cape. Neat. And here's our doll. A glitter glam one. Glam glitter. The queen. Whoa. Let's put on her gold jumpsuit. There it goes. And now these white glitter boots. Oh, come on, get on there. Just take a look at her hair. It's got this black glitter shimmer, all different colors to it. And she's got glittery blue eyes. Did you guess we would get the queen? If so, say I got it in the comments. Mm -mm -mm. Thanks for saving me a spot here, guys. Ah, uh, the queen needs to relax. Oh wait, but I did bring some surprises for you guys. What is it? What is it? Whoa, 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 excuse me, sissy. It's a five surprise. Whoa, that means enough surprises for everyone. Yay. Yes, there definitely should be enough surprises in here for everyone. No more waiting. Let's get this five surprise open. Pull off the tab and <laughs> all the surprise slices open up. Here's the first one we'll take a look at. Hey, it's got our guide in it too. And a cool flying pterodactyl. Ah, ah. In this five surprise, we could get like putty, slime, water balloons, skateboards, cars, sea creatures, dinos, insects. Oh, yucky, yucky stuff here. Oh, those dogs and glowing, squishies and squeezers, super balls, army men, ninjas, key pens, and even some silly bands or stickers and things like that. I think it's time to open up another one of these slices. What are these? Hmm, gotta unwrap it to find out. Looks like silly bands. Oh, what shapes do we have? A dinosaur, maybe a T-Rex. Looks like all different kinds of dinosaurs. Let's see some of the others. Ooh, no, a tarantula maybe. <gasps> Scorpion. Ooh, and some kind of beetle. Super cool, but we want more. Off comes this, and out we have. Is this gonna be one of the sticky guys? I think so. Come on out of there. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, he sure is sticky. Looks like a sticky tentacle octopus. All his tentacles are even sticking together. We've still got more surprises to get to. I love these. <gasps> a skateboard. How awesome. You can jump ramps and wheelie around. Woo! Here it is, the last of our five surprises. Ew! I think it's a prank toy. Let's look at these. Do you know what they're supposed to be? Little maggots. Oh, I bet you could really scare somebody. Huh, you know what? Getting a little warm here. The queen does not like to get sweaty. I'm out. <laughs> Stop right there, sir. Stop right there. You on the skateboard. Wow, punk boy. Oh, hey, Pharaoh babe. That looked super amazing. Thank 
things. I've really been working on my skills. It was so fast though. Don't you think you might want to slow down a little bit? Nah, the faster the better, I say. Oh, alright. Well, it was cool to check you out, but I gotta head off. Oh yeah? What are you up to? Oh, um, nothing really. Just, um, uh, checking out some new stuff. Uh, I'll catch you later. Hmm, <laughs> that was strange. Oh well, back to my skateboarding. Woo! Would you like to see what Pharaoh Babe is up to today? If so, hit the thumbs up button and click to subscribe. Well, here it is. Finally, at last, my very own business. I get to have my own police station because I do not like crime. Hmm, well, let's check it out in here. Isn't this place neat? Oh, whoa, look, security cameras and clipboards and filing. Oh, here's where you take their picture. I love it, I love it, but I do feel like it's missing some things. I've got a few more things to add in here, I think. Pharaoh Babe's got this new police station. She's gonna play a trick on Punk Boy and get him arrested. Just for pretend. Why do you think he'll get arrested? For taking something? For speeding? Or for lying? Put your guess in the comments. Let's start over here. Looks like we've got a little air conditioning vent and this gray wall. I think it will be perfect for this storage shelf, which can slide in here. We'll just push that in. Excellent. And to go with that shelf, we have this sign. It says, stop, police. <laughs> so the sign, the police can hold up the sign when they need someone to stop. Clip that in here. Then we've also got this policeman's wand that just gets clipped in here. That looks good. We've got a camera for taking some of the criminal's pictures. I think that can go on the shelf. Here is another gray shelf for setting any supplies and things. That slides right in. And then a step up just to get to our things. Oh yes, let me check this out. If I step up here, I can get my supplies. Da, 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 da. Perfect. A little more work to do over here though. We need to put in some lights overhead for when we take the pictures of those coming in. It looks good, they can be adjusted up or down. Here's the screen where we can see how the picture looks and that will get clipped in here and it can be moved and adjusted. I have another spot here. I can put our handcuffs, keep anybody from getting away. On this side, we can put in a couple more clips. I'll do that one and there for our keys for handcuffs and different things like that. And you may need a flashlight at times if things get dark. Oop. We just need a few more things in here. We've got a desk for police officers to work at with a keyboard to type in information and a chair. Let's see, everything's looking amazing. My police station is ready. Hmm, but nothing's really going on. Hmm, la la la. Uh, guess I could sit down for a minute. No, everything over here is good. Wow, I thought having a police station would be a little more exciting. Hi there, Pharaoh Babe. Oh, oh, oh my, what's this? Whoa! Sorry about that. I found this guy riding someone else's bike. What? Someone else's bike? That's not okay. What? They weren't using it. No harm done. Excuse me, mister, but that is not okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, come on, over here to take your picture. Yes, right this way. Let's just get this clipped on you so you can't get away. And you're gonna stand in front of the lines. Ooh, 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 we've gotta get the camera. It's over here. I've got it. There you go, officer. Thank you, Pharaoh babe. We'll fix these lights. And look this way, please. Ah, uh, how'd that turn out? Pretty good. Oh wait, we need to bring in your numbers. This is your booking number. One more picture. Click. Ah, uh, much better. What will you do with him now? Oh, now we'll take him over to the jail until we get everything all sorted out. Oh, the jail, no! That's right, mister. This way. Oh my, that was so very exciting. Hmm, but nothing else going on here now. Ah, la 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 la. Uh, I'm getting a little bored here. Hmm. I want to get someone else's picture standing over there. Who could I get? Well, they'd have to be doing something wrong. 
Hmm, unless I just played a little trick. <gasps> Punk boy. Yeah, he was going super fast on his skateboard. I'll have a police officer pick him up. Shh, shh. Uh, Officer Tim? Come in, Officer Tim. Uh, yes, this is Officer Tim. Hi, uh, I need you to pick up Punk Boy. He is skateboarding way too fast. We need to bring him in. Roger that. I'll bring him in right away. Over and out. <laughs> I'm so silly. This is gonna be hilarious. No! Watch out! Coming through! I can even go up the ramp! Skateboarding! Stop right there, sir! Stop right there! You on the skateboard! Huh? What's going on? What's the problem, officer? Excuse me, young man. The problem is you. I need you to step off that skateboard at this moment. What? What's going on? I don't understand. I'm just skateboarding. I ask you to please get off the skateboard. All right, all right, all right. What is it, officer? What's wrong? You were going way too fast on that skateboard. Huh? Skateboards are for going fast. Don't you know that? Don't talk back to me. I I I'm not, I'm not. I'm, I'm sorry, officer. It's just a skateboard I was riding around. Riding around too fast. We've gotten some complaints. You need to come with me. Huh? What are you talking about, come with you? I'm just riding a skateboard. Hey, that's enough. Do not yell at this officer. Come on, you're coming with me. What, what, what's going on? I don't understand. Okay, listen, I I'm just playing a prank on my friend. I had him come in for speeding on a skateboard. Speeding on a skateboard, is that a thing? No, that's why it's just a trick. But he can't see me, he'll know what's up. So will you take care of it for me? You know, pretend he's getting arrested. Are you sure that's okay? Yeah, yeah, it'll be fine. Oh, they're coming, I'm gonna hide. Oh, I'm sorry officer, I just don't understand. Hello there, I brought this person in here because he was speeding on his skateboard. Oh yes, I've heard about this. Thank you so much, officer. I'll take care of it from here. Right, back on patrol. Excuse me, officer, I just don't understand. How could I be speeding on a skateboard? I just know my orders, and that was to take you in. Come on, we've gotta get your picture. My picture? Are you serious? Absolutely, this way. Oh, I don't believe this, what's happening? We'll just need to put this on you. Huh, a handcuff? No, 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 don't. Hey, hey, be still, be still, calm down. I just, I can't, I don't understand. This is getting crazy. That's it, let me just get a number for you. That goes in front of you. Oh my goodness, I can't believe this is happening. What will my friends say? They'll say you need to be more careful next time. Now, look at the camera. Oh no. Click. That ought to do it. Let me just put this in the computer. Okay. Come on over here with me. Oh no, maybe this wasn't a good idea. I shouldn't probably play a prank like this. Uh, maybe I should stop them. Could someone please explain things to me? Well, I may have to take you to the jail. <gasps> the jail? No, no, I really didn't do anything wrong. I, I promise, I promise, it'll never happen again. Oh. Oh no. Oh no, punk boy, I'm so sorry. Sorry, uh, Pharaoh babe, what are you doing here? Uh, uh, this is my police station, this is what I was doing. I, I don't understand. I, I was kind of bored, so I thought I'd play a little trick on you. Uh, you're really not under arrest, it, it, it was all pretend. Pretend? That was not nice at all, I thought it was real. I know, I know, I've learned my lesson, I'm so sorry. Well. I'm glad you apologized, but I think I have to go. Oh no, I made a terrible mistake. I should have never played a prank on him. No, that was definitely not a nice thing to do. I think I will stand here in the handcuffs until I've learned my lesson. Good thinking. I'll be at the computer if you need anything. Did you guess that Punk Boy would go to the police station for speeding? If so, say I got it in the comments. Ah, made it, second floor. Oh no, my key. This is it, little Pharaoh babe. Wow, what a neat place. That's right, we're opening up our very own hotel. This is our hotel building. All right, all right, can we go inside and check it out? Yeah, but I should tell you, it's not really ready inside yet. It's not? No, we've got a lot of work to do. Just the outside has been completed. Oh my, it's so big though. Yes it is, but we can do it together, yeah. 
partners. Let's check it out. Well, here we are. All right, this is incredible. Yes, this is the main lobby where customers will come in. Um, you're right, it is kind of missing stuff here. I know, I know. Oh, but see, this is where our safe is so we can keep our customers' valuable things safe. And we got a magazine rack. All right, let's get some things put together. Would you like to see Favor Babe and Little Favor Babe get their hotel put together? If so, hit the thumbs up button and click to subscribe. I think the first thing we should bring in here is a counter. The customers will come up to the counter to check in. And in order to check in, we're gonna need a hotel worker dressed and ready. On her counter, she has the book of the guests and when they're checking in, and a phone in case the guests need to call from their room or she can call them. On the magazine rack, we'll put a book about cycling and it has maps to different cycling locations. And then we also have this kind of outdoor water sports activity book for the customers to check out. We'll put a welcoming little plant back here. And we want customers to know that they can do some water activities. So we'll bring in a surfboard. Whoops. They can borrow the surfboard to do some water activities. And, and even a snorkel. Looks like we're all ready in here. Yes, ma'am. I am ready for any customers that come in and need to stay at our hotel. Well, that's good. But I'm afraid the rest of our hotel is not ready yet. So I hope no customers come in. I'll let you know if they do. Thanks, I'm gonna try and get everything set up. Sissy, Sissy, come look over here. Yes, yes, what do you see? What is this space for? It's kind of strange. Oh, I didn't tell you, did I? Huh, tell me what? Well, our hotel's gonna be a little more special than every other hotel. What do you mean, what do you mean? We're gonna have a toy hotel. What, a toy hotel? What's that mean? It means we've got this special area right here just for kids and toys. And there'll be some toys left in every room for little ones to play with. <gasps> That's so nice of you. Yes, I want everyone to feel welcome. Does that mean we can get the toy area all set up? We sure can. Wanna help me with it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. In our special toy area for kids, we'll set down this fun little map. It looks like it's got water and sand. Here is a bucket of toys. Let's see what we've got in there. Oh, a soccer ball is fun to play with. And we also have some sand tools for playing out at the beach. Here's a bucket, a little rake and shovel to use in the sand. We have a watering can. It helps when you make the sand a little bit wet. And this little sieve so we can put sand in there and shake it up and see what kind of shells and things we can find. Perfect little bucket right over here for all those fun toys. Then we also have this. It's a little ark, a boat. If I take the lid off, you can see there are a bunch of animals inside. And let's check out what we have. First, we have the little people that are taking care of the animals in the ark. And then we have two of everything. Two giraffes, two zebras, two camels. Here's two lions, a male and a female. Two rhinos, and finally, two elephants. And then you can put the lid back on and they can sail away over the water. Oh, Sissy, I really love this toy room. I'm so glad that you do, because if you do, it means the other kids will like it too. Hmm, do you think that I could play here while you set up the rest of the hotel? Yeah, that's probably a good idea anyway. All right. Little Unicorn will visit the hotel later. Which animal do you think she'll want to play with? Will it be the elephant, the lions, or the giraffes? Put your guess in the comments. Let me check out this boat and animals. Be good, I'll just be in the hotel if you need me. Things are looking good, I guess I can move on. I've got the lobby set up, the toy area is ready, and now we need to get the cafe ready. Our coffee machine is in, we'll need some juices, here's our counter for our baked goods. All right, I guess I better start bringing stuff in. Bring in some coffee mugs, those will be important for when the customers want to get some coffee from the coffee machine. We'll also add some apple juice and orange juice here for those that don't want coffee. We've got yummy breads to set out. And to go with that bread, 
bread, a tray of cheese, and finally, some fruit. A few green apples. That looks nice. In the cafe, we of course need to have a table. Got a few chairs to set around it. And we even have a high chair for little ones to eat at. I'm going to need someone to work in here in the cafe for me, serving our customers. I am here. I can do it, Pharaoh Babe. I've already got the coffee pot ready. Oh, that's excellent. Thank you so much. Well, I've got things under control here. You could go check out the rest of the hotel if you'd like. Oh, that would be such a big help. Let me see. Oh, I think the elevator is this way. So no customers, right? No, ma'am. Oh, thank goodness. All right, I'm getting things done. I just need to head upstairs to the second floor where the rooms are. We will close the little doors on the elevator. And up you go. Second floor. All right, next room. Huh, one of the bedrooms for everyone to sleep in. But oh my, no beds. Uh, we're missing so much stuff. Don't worry, Pharaoh babe, you can do this. Come on, get things together. Let's start by setting up the bathroom. We need a shower head to go in here. Excellent. And then a potty, of course, can go right up against the wall there. So I think our bathroom is all ready to go. Of course, we need the bed to go in here. That looks like a nice spot. Plus, sometimes we have kids with us, so the bunk beds are gonna go in this room. We've got a little table to go on the side of the bed here where we'll put some fresh flowers for them. Here is the phone that goes in the bedroom here. That's gonna go up by the bed. A little chair at the table in case you need to do some work. And we've even got an alarm clock to wake you up. And finally, since it's a toy hotel, we have a couple toys. A little porcupine and teddy bear. I'm gonna set one of those on each of the bunk beds. Oh, I hope the kids like their toys. I want this to be a special place for kids. I hope they like the toy hotel. I bet little Pharaoh Babe's having fun. All right, time to check on the next room. Oh, oh, hello there. Hi, I'm one of your cleaning ladies. Oh, it's so nice to meet you. Yes, I've just been cleaning the floor and I see that we need to get some stuff moved in. Yes, I've been working on that. I did room 101 already. Maybe you could check on the beds, make sure everything's nice and neatly made. Of course, ma'am. Well, that's good. Now to get things set up in here, and then we'll be all ready. Let's open up the doors to the bathroom, and we will start there with our shower and our potty. Then we can close up the bathroom. The sink is already inside. In this room, the big bed will go on this side, and we'll put our table over here with the chair, some fresh flowers on those table, and the phone. I don't want to forget about the little alarm clock. Now in this room, we'll also put a crib in case someone needs it. The sides fold down so you can get the little one out very easily. In the cradle, we'll put a little blue snail. I'll also put in a little ducky. This room has a special balcony that connects outside, so I'll put a little lounge chair there. Oh boy, this is it. It means the hotel's ready now. Oh, I'm gonna check in the lobby, see if customers are coming in yet. Hello there, is this where we check in to get our room key? Yes ma'am, it is. Can I have your names please? Hi, I am Heartbreaker here with Little Heartbreaker. And I'm Unicorn, I'm here with Little Unicorn. All right, I'm just gonna check our book. And yes, I see that both of you have reservations here. Uh, just need to grab your keys. Unicorn, you'll be in room 101. That sounds good. And Heartbreaker, you'll be in room 102. Perfect, right next to you. I just wanna let you know that there is a toy room right next door to our lobby here where little ones can play, as well as a cafe where you can get some refreshments refreshments and the elevator is just out here and that will take you up to your rooms. Ooh, toys, toys, let's go play, play. Uh, not just yet. We need to get settled in our rooms first. All right. Yes, and we've got to grab our luggage from the car. Oh yeah. All right, well let's head out. All right, little heartbreaker, I've got our suitcase. Let's get onto the elevator. Shall we go up? No, no, wait for friends. All right. We're coming, we're coming. Wow, that's a pretty big suitcase. Yeah, I might have overpacked. Uh, let's see if I can get this on the elevator. Oh, it's kind of squishy on here. Can we get the doors closed? Yep, they're closed. Going up. Ah, made it, second floor. Oh, look, we found our rooms. Here's ours, 102. 
Yes, and we're just right next to you. We found our rooms. Here's 101. That's us. Yes, and we're right next to you in 102. All right, see you in a few minutes. Now let's see how we do this. The key goes in and just press down and our door should open. There we go. We can go inside now. Okay, little heartbreaker, let's see if our door key is working. Press down and open up. Perfect. I want to see. I want to see. Oh, my little unicorn. Look how nice this room is. It's gorgeous. Ah, oh, and a comfy bed to lay in. Oh, yeah. Bed for jumping, jumping, jumping. Ooh, what's in my bed? Bunk beds with a teddy bear? What's up here? Oh, little hedgehog. How cute. I love the toy hotel. Hey, maybe little heartbreaker can have a sleepover with me one night. Yeah, sure, whatever you want, as long as I can relax. Wow, little heartbreaker, what a nice room. I know, look at this bed for me. I don't think so. Pretty sure that's a bed for me. Oh, you can share, because I don't want to sleep in the baby crib. I'm too big for this. Oh, but I do like these toys. Let's see. Oh, a ducky for the bath. And a little snail. How cute. Hmm, maybe I'll go see what unicorn's bed is. Knock, 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 knock. I'll get it. Yes? Hi, I just came to see unicorn's bed. All right. Wow, you got bunk beds? Yeah, want to stay with me? Yeah, I have a crib in my room. Oh, that's no good. Oh, a teddy bear. How cool. Hey, want to go play in the toy room now? Uh-huh. Come on, Sissy, wake up, wake up, wake up. We want to go to the toy room. All right, let's get Heartbreaker. Hi, did you say there was a toy room around here? Yes, ma'am, just around the corner behind you. Oh, perfect. All right, girls, it's just over here. Oh, wow, toy room in the toy hotel. Yeah, how cool. So much. Hi, what's your name? I'm the Pharaoh Babe. You guys want to play here with me? Uh-huh. What do you say you and I check out this cafe? It's just right next door. Let's do it. Hey girls, we'll just be right over here in the cafe if you need us. Okay, we'll play. Oh, perfect. There's a table open. Hello there, ladies. Can I get you anything? Oh, I'd love a cup of coffee. Um, maybe just an apple? Coming right up. I'm really glad we decided to take this trip together. Yeah, the girls are having fun, and we can get a little bit of relaxation. There you go, ladies. A cup of coffee and an apple. I'll be here if you need anything else. Thank you, sir. What do you think you might want to do tomorrow? Hmm, good question. They have a lot of outdoor water activities. Yeah, I saw the surfboard and the snorkel. I'd love to see some fish. Sounds like a great plan, and I think the girls will love it. Shall we go check on them? Probably a good idea. Wow, look at all these animals. Yeah, I, I know. My favorite are the zebras. I like that they're black and white. And I like these funny camels. Hmm, what's my favorite? I know, the giraffe with the tall, tall neck. Yay! Did you guess that unicorn's favorite animal would be the giraffe? If so, say I got it in the comments. Come on, let's play. We're having so much fun together. Oh my goodness, aren't they just so cute playing together? They really are. We should take a photo of this. I don't think I brought my camera. I did, but oh, I must have left it upstairs at the room. I'll go grab it real quick. You stay with them. Okay, we'll be here. I'll be fast. Hmm. Okay. Let's see. Oh. Oh no, my key. Uh. Oh no. Oh, I can't get in. Uh. Oh. I see the. Oh, I see my camera on the bed, and ah, uh, my room key's right next to it. What am I gonna do? How can I get in my room? This is a disaster. All my stuff is in there. Oh no, oh no. Oh, excuse me, ma'am. Do you need some help? Yes, I'm locked out of my room. Can you let me in? I sure can. Here you go. Oh, thank goodness. What a lifesaver. Now I can grab my camera and my key. Wow, what took so long? Oh, I forgot to bring my room key, so I was locked out. Thankfully, the housekeeper helped me get in. Oh no, I hope I have my key on me. Oh, the favorite baby, all right? Yeah, sorry. I think I was just getting sleepy. Oh, goodness. Well, let me take a picture quick. I've got my camera here. Okay, everyone smile. Say cheese. Cheese. Click. Hmm, they are looking a little sleepy. They sure are. Thinking maybe it's time to head upstairs to the bed. Okay, sissy. 
but can we come back down and play tomorrow? Of course you can. We'll have all kinds of excitement tomorrow. Huh, <sighs> good, because I am sleepy. All right, let's go back up to the rooms and tuck you in bed. Night-night.